Get ready with me while I show you everything that I brought for a month long trip to Europe. I had to be very selective about what products that I was picking because it is definitely like one of the heaviest things in my suitcase. Starting with this Blur and Hydrate Primer from Refi Beauty. I just started using it, but I love Refi Beauty's products because they have this applicator that I find to be very cooling. I only brought two foundations with me. The first one is this Makeup Forever HD Skin Hydro Glow Foundation. I use the shade 2N22. I love it for days at like the beach or if I don't really want to like put tons of makeup on my skin. I'm obsessed with the Summer Friday Sheer Skin Tint and I use shade 4. When it came to brushes, I knew that I had to bring my F4 brush from Makeup by Mario. I find that this product really lasts the whole entire day, especially through the heat and humidity of being in France, especially when there's a lack of air conditioning. Concealer, I brought my two favorites, which is the Natasha Denona Concealer in shade RN3. However, I'm like running out of this. So I also love the Giorgio Armani Concealer in shade 4.5 for Cream contour, I brought my Rare Beauty in shade Bright Side, which I love. It's a very creamy formula. And then for some more precision, this Victoria Beckham Contour Stylist is genius. It's great for like the nose or other areas that you really want like sharp definition. My thing about makeup in Europe is I'm really just trying to use a lot less product. I'm really like trying to get more confident and comfortable, just like not having pounds of makeup on my skin. <laughs> trying i'm obsessed with the road pocket blushes i brought two of them with me i think the other one is sprinkle that i got at the nyc pop-up which i think that they released online but i'm actually digging this shade this is the freckle shade i like that it's not super pink it like put some here and recently i've been seeing people just like go straight for their nose interesting so my boyfriend's family is french and they don't really use that much makeup they're very like effortlessly cool eyebrows i have two products pencil i'm obsessed with this from sonia's brow bar really the only thing i know how to use on my eyebrows i really would like to be better at defining my eyebrows in fact i would think that i need to just get them dyed the brow freeze gel from anastasia and it's just the best before i powder i just like to spray my entire face with the charlotte tilbury setting spray i let that dry and then i'm gonna go in with my absolute holy grail of a product which is the prism libre from givenchy this powder loose powder obsessed with this i'm just gonna put it on this mario brush this is the f2 and i'm really just gonna kind of just go over my entire face for mascara i am just in love with this from mac it's called the mac stack this is waterproof blush i'm obsessed with this one from fenty it's called juicy peach you see how nice that is it has like a little shine to it now i'm gonna go in with a little bronzer this is my favorite from gucci beauty it was expensive but honestly this has lasted me like two years so and we still got a lot so we might need to get another one after this video but this beauty brush i love this brush it's like super viral for a reason it's fantastic i really didn't bring that many brushes on this trip so I love like a multi-purpose brush. If this is my look, I would go in with like a little lip liner or something, but I love that the Rode Beauty blush is still on my lips. So I'm just gonna keep it like that for now. And thank you guys so much for watching and I love you so much. Have a great day. Bye.